Hey, how's it going? It's Pastor Josh here. Hope you guys are having a great week. I hope that your uh, growth groups are uh, functioning uh, amazingly. I, I know we have great leaders. We have great groups. I've been hearing great comments about uh, the interactions, and I just I love I love what I'm hearing. And so we're in a series called Jesus Is. Jesus Is, and we're talking about the identity of Christ. Who is Christ? Because sometimes we have an image, even if we've been coming to church for a while, we have a certain image uh, or an idea about who Jesus is. And so in this series, we're going to be talking about not what our conception of Jesus is, but what is it that the Bible says about Jesus and, and his identity. And so uh, the first week we were talking about Jesus is risen. We were talking about Jesus is risen. And last week uh, we talked about Jesus is my friend. Jesus is my friend. Now, this may seem strange. I mean, when I think about the creator of the universe wanting to be my friend, that's pretty amazing. Now, the interesting thing is that we're going to be looking at John chapter 15. And John chapter 15 talks about Jesus' desire to have an intimate relationship with us. In fact, he says, I no longer call you slaves. I call you friends. So he wants to be our friend. But the interesting thing is that there's a caveat because his friendship with us has a requirement. Now, this may seem strange because if, if I want to be your friend and I'm like, hey, do you want to be my friend? And you say yes. And I say, okay, we'll be friends as long as you do what I say. That's a strange friendship, right? However, Jesus is talking about this whole idea of trust, of trust. And so there's a direct correlation between our level of friendship, our level of intimacy, and our level of trust. And so we're going to be talking about this uh, in our growth groups this week. And so I hope you enjoy your group and I'll see you Sunday.